Greetings Virgo, welcome to your horoscope. Yeah, there's some people that have trouble orgasming. It's sad, I know, or they feel jealous of other people having pleasure. I, I had a relationship with somebody like that once, that was really interesting. You know what that is? It's not being within yourself. That means that you're not present. You're not present with yourself. You're not present with your lovers. Be present with yourself. Love yourself first. Virgo, you spend a lot of time criticizing yourself, and yet you're one of the most useful signs in the zodiac because you're the one who recognizes the problem. And the main problem is, is that we're not working on solutions enough. And here's the solution. Let's unite. Let's hold hands. Let's love one another. Let's have a love fest. Let's find out what our needs are and let's get with those needs met. Let's get each other all out of debt. Let's get each other all a place where we can grow food sustainably. Keep warm sustainably in a good way. Honor our animal brothers and sisters around us. And I mean, there's some people who are pretty radical, so they don't eat them. Some people, some animals need to be eating other animals, okay? That's, and that's okay too. It's like we can love all of them. It doesn't matter, you know, every one of them. That's the good part about right now. And for you is you're intelligent enough and you're humble enough to recognize the power of the servant, the servant energy. It's not the servant that likes to play tricks on other people and holds higher standards to others that provide them money sometimes doing horrible things like taxing or incarcerating or doing all those things you know that not that kind of servant you know that's not a solution servant that's that's a greedy bastard <laughs> you know that's part of the problem so we have to find a solution to that it says why are you so hungry why are you having such problems ma mismanaging why are you so in love with paperwork and putting people away and doing things to hurt them than allowing them to become better people we don't make people better people by threatening them and hurting them. That's We've tried that for thousands of years and it still hasn't worked. But we do make them better people by loving them. So when you do service like loving, like when Jesus washed his disciples' feet, for instance, that is the message. That is the answer. It's that simple. He said, you can go and forgive sins. You know, it's not only God can forgive sins. You know, this is a this is a stupid mess people have gotten into. You can forgive people's sins too. Just be forgiving. <laughs> That's all it takes, and you will heal them. 